Well, the trendsetter Hawks were crowned double champions in the Peace and Love football tournament held at St. Paul Street grounds. In the under-15 tournament, the Hawks got the better of John John and in the senior finals defeated the defense force. Ken Fuentes tells us more. It had been an exciting competition and now it was time to determine champions of the tournament. In the under-15 final, John John came up against trendsetter Hawks. Trendsetter Hawks would get on the scoreboard first, taking advantage of a mistake by the John John goalkeeper. With the rain pouring down, Trendsetter Hawks flooded their opponent's goal. Former national goalkeeper Clayton Ince getting a close up view of the talent as he refereed the game. And the Hawks would complete the victory in style to wrap up the under 15 title with a comfortable 4 0 victory over John John. In the open final, Trendsetter Hawks senior team took on the defense force. And it was the defense force that would get the game's opening goal. Before the Army custodian tried one too many touches and gifted Hawks the equalizer. Penalties needed to decide this one and it was Hawks that claimed their second title on the day, 3-2 from the spot. Superintendent Subhas Ramkilawan, head of community-oriented policing, thanked the residents for their unity throughout the tournament. So give yourself a lusty round of applause for the part you played in making this a success. We were here at the opening ceremony when we were blessed through the heavens with rain, water galore, but that didn't stop this tournament from coming off. I can safely say it is because of the peace and the love within the minds and the hearts and the souls of the gathered here today. And those that made it possible, we are all winners. And encourage the communities to continue to work together. So from today onwards, let us say peace and love. St. Paul Street, peace and love in the harp. Peace and love, Silats. Peace and love, Lavantil. Peace and love, throughout Trinidad and Tobago. And let it be sports, let it be football, let it be cricket, but most of all, let it be the love for humanity that exists amongst us all. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports.